It it's is cruise, cruise day. day. And there's like Coney Island down there. How cool. And there she is. Cheer, first cheer of the cruise. Boop. It it's is cruise, cruise day. day. So it is Saturday morning. We got in super early, 2.15 this morning into Galveston. Talk about that later. But we woke up and we're heading on to the Jubilee. Yeah, yeah, so cruise day, we're very excited. But yeah, last night after we dropped off the pups, it was a long flight, got into Houston, Houston at midnight and then a nice long Uber ride. We're at the hotel at 2 a.m. So thanks so, Marcel. I'm glad we slept in a little bit. Had, we had a good breakfast which we just showed you and now yeah let's go get on a ship and look at our view here. We got a little Coney Island. Yeah that is very cool. And then there's a whole bunch of tankers out there. Yeah so we're staying at the Double Tree at Galveston Beach here. So we could have walked around and did the beach. Quickest little room tour of the Double Tree. We got nice, I mean, it's been lived in. Hello. <laughs> but yeah, very nice room. We have two queens. This one not lived in. Look at that. And here we go. Coffee maker. Cool little fridge. We like that. And my coffee trash. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this view right here. Ocean view and a balcony. Does anybody know why there's only like <laughs> a half curtain? Do you yeah. think it's to be to cover the eye line of the pillows from the sun? Yeah, uh, leave us a maybe so. And let me know what you it, think this little half curtain is. The curtain liter rod literally <laughs> stops right there. So. I don't think we've ever seen that before. It does shield a little bit, I guess, if your head's right there, but interesting. <laughs> okay, so quick little shot of the pool area. Look at this. How cool. So this is the double tree. But yeah, it looks like a nice little bar right here. I assume you could get food, drink, and sit right on the pier with this view right here. And then, yeah, you can just walk, walk this whole area. And there's a like Coney Island down there. How cool. A lot of people walk on the beach. It's 58 degrees. So, yeah, just double tree by Hilton right on Galveston Beach. And I think Andrea's ready for our Uber. And there she is. Make a run together, I'll be by your side Before we collide And if the sky falls down on you Just beat it up Before we collide Let's make it last forever I'm ready to fly Before we collide And when the sun don't shine on you Just heat it 
Jubilee Casino here. Everything nice and new. Alright, we just did the muster super quick. Just hand them your pass and check and in. And basically just said life jackets will be found at muster, so we're done. In the casino. Done. Alright, her first platinum. Let's see. Hey, it? it's actually there. You got it? We have two platinums. Woohoo! Her first one, first platinum. Oh, here's our cabin, everybody. Yeah, we have a fruit bowl. Nice. Nothing like a little fresh fruit. Well, look at that. Welcome aboard Carnival Jubilee. Hi. Oh, they have new towels. Okay. They have striped towels now. Cool, cool. Okay, so we will do a quick little cabin tour. So it'll be very familiar. We've done cabin tours on Celebration and Mardi Gras. This should be the same layout. Got nice lights everywhere. TV by your bed. And the little USBs. And Andrea will show you the bathroom, which is her favorite. <laughs> because it has the door. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, it's got the door. And yeah, looks roomy enough. Very good. There we are. And do you need to put a card in here to get your lights? Shelves, closet. Should be a safe hiding somewhere. Oh yeah, so you do yeah. have plenty of wardrobe space. Yep, so the safe is in here with your little rollout. And if you need to know where your muster is, if you haven't already done it, it says right here on the Right on wall. the door. And you do have a cooler for your water and whatever you want. Plenty of drawers, should be a hair dryer. Nope. It's in there, I'm sure. There hair it is. Hair dryer. All right, so I like this nice little table and chairs. Oh, looks like a parade happening down there. A little street carnival. Mm, that wraps up the room tour. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Quick room tour. All right, a little look around deck eight. Here's the Rudy Sea Grill. And deli sandwiches, so they call it beach buns. That's funny. Beach buns. You want a beach bun? Probably. I brought my own bun. What about that? Oh, Coastal Slice. Okay, that's pizza. Smells very good. Oh yeah, and they have the drinks now at the end. Which is very ocean. helpful. Very. Oh, Marina Bar. So we're here for first drink. It's got to be a fun ship. And we're at the Marina Bar. Marina Bar. So, cheers. Cheers, happy cruising. Are you sure I bring it back now? Yeah, yeah. Perfect. From scratch. From scratch. Oh, it's Kindle Fire. We have chicken burger. 
deck down, deck down. Okay, outs have a regular one without cheese. Without cheese? Huh. A regular one. Okay, we had the first guy's burger of the trip. I pretty much got a plain Jane, no cheese, so that looks fantastic. Andrea got the same thing. We do still have our fun chips, so time to eat lunch. Guy's burgers. And they have their own separate area here on this ship, on the Excel class. It's a giant area with seating. Alright, first bite, guy's burger. That's super good. Crispy edges on the patty. Nice little sauteed onion. Tiny little bit of chili. Very good. Now the only thing they haven't brought back yet from the topping bar is the sauteed mushroom. Alright, here is our view here. Right outside of Guy's Burger. Look at the harbor here. And we have a past ship of ours, Carnival Dream 2017. We did the dream, and maybe I'll put in a little clip of what happened to me in the Cloud9 Spa. the bolt right there. Ropes course. Ropes course, yep. Yeah. We may have to try this ropes course for sure. But yeah, the dream. We need to redo the dream. And Andrea's a bit chill. A little chilly. It's about 58, but we're in the shade. Yeah. So, might be jacking for a sail away. It's like a Royal Caribbean ship down there too. We're not sure which one that is. Alright, so one cool thing about the Excel class, when you know the layout, you know the layout. You know there's a sea dogs right there. Shawarma, yep. That's hot dog at sea. Yeah, this hot dog is no joke, so we're gonna have to get this someday. Yeah, look at them, they got the nice grill marks. Yeah, we like the hot dog. Oh, the pretzel buns are now wrapped. Before we found that they were softer. hard. I bet you that does. That probably oh, solved we'll the problem. Oh, try one, don't worry. Yeah, so this is the Lido Deck Buffet. And then midship down here is gonna be Street Eats. The Lido Deck. There's gonna be a big party oh, here at Sail Away. Yeah. Seafood check, very good. And now here's Street Eats. Oh, Texas chili fries. Oh, dumplings, beef kebab. And you normally see the ocean out here, but now the wonderful city of Galveston. You know we're in Texas. <laughs> we are in Texas. All right, one more time through the casino. We have had comments to show the casino more. <laughs> so here is the Jubilee brand new casino. Ooh, that looks like a fun one. Going cash? No, gone cash. <laughs> Egyptian jewels. We'll see if we can find some of the machines that we like. You got a nice bar right here. Oh, I like these wheels. Let us know if you've had luck on machines like this one. I kind of like these with the spin. Oh, we got some buffaloes. <laughs> Who doesn't like a buffalo? Choose your game. Alright, just like on Mardi Gras, going through, we have the Grand View Bar here. Whoa, look at that. Wow. That is so cool. Oh, that's cool. Welcome aboard. Little casino. 
casino action. Pay no attention behind the curtain. Oh yeah, Mardi Gras had this little section right here. Alright, so it's called Grand Central on Jubilee. Here's the Alchemy Bar. Look at this. Ooh. Okay, the decor is really cool. Look at the. Look at, it's like you're under a little aquarium. Okay, here's our alchemy bar, folks. This is giving me like deja vu vibes. <laughs> All over again. Yeah. New Year's Eve. So just like on Mardi Gras, there's Fahrenheit 555 Steakhouse and it is on deck seven and they have their own bar right there. And we found our uh, dining. So we are Pacific and we just stumbled across it. There we go. All right, well, let's go down to six. Whoa, look I at like the floor. I like these swimming fish on the pole. These are the stairs that get more narrow as you go down. It really plays with the eyes. <laughs> All right, here is Carnival Kitchen. And we are doing this on the last sea day. We're going to learn how to make some emeralds. Yeah, so we're going to make some emeralds food. Yeah. So who's excited for that? Bam! And we found our favorite place, emeralds. This is one of the best new venues on any carnival ship. We love it so much. Oh, so they have all kinds of great stuff here. Look at this. Drinks PhD. So on celebration Dr. it was called Well celebration Latitudes. Was called Latitudes, but this is Dr. Inks. Dr. Inks are drinks for short. Oh yeah. And on celebration we would sit here. Listen to Reggie. And we would watch Reggie right there. I like it, I like it. I found the hidden Mickey. Oh, hidden Mickey over here. See it? Okay, so this way is going to be another restaurant. God, look how big these tables are. A lot of hidden Mickeys here. Okay, Mardi Gras, we've eaten here. We had oh, a table like yeah, right there. Yeah, we were there. literally right inside the door there. Oh, and we found the ship. Well, we're oh, on the, oh, the here's Golden, the golden Mermaid. Mermaid. Okay, so this used to be Brass Magnolia. Brass Magnolia, yeah. Right here with, on the Mardi Gras is Brass Magnolia. It looks just as nice. Look at this. Holy cow. So fancy. All right, yeah, I like it, man. And look what we have here. We have the Jubilee in all her glory. Not the carnival glory, but there you go. No pun intended. And on celebration, they have the car here from the older carnival ship. Ecstasy, was it? Money changer over there. Cherry on top. If you like your sweets. And Java Blue. Java Blue. We can get all your specialty coffee, hot chocolates. And you could just get complimentary coffee right over here. Coffee, tea, water. Oh, we're coming up on the piano bar. Yep. There's so. the old Jubilee, the original. Apparently it's the Jubilee and the Celebration. Cool, I like it. Oh. Let's make a run together, I'll be by your side Before we collide And if the sky falls down on you Just be right, here six, we have the gym. 
Cloud9 Fitness Center. Oh, look at them all. Okay, this is very fancy. This is very nice. And then yeah, it is very nice. When you use the treadmills, you get a view of the sea, so. This might be a little better than our gym back home. Yeah. Definitely more treadmills, way more, and they have a good view. I'm going to be needing to use this, so maybe I can get Andy to join. Maybe. which is on the other side, we'll show you, they are more of the sugary. So if you want more sugary, go to Dr. Inks. If you want less sugary, more citrus, come to the Golden Mermaid. Oh, look at the smoke coming out. It, is, it does glisten a little. Yeah. Oh, oh thank nice. you. Oh, and if you could smell it. I know, right? We need like smell of it. Smell of vision. Right All right. It smells good. Good All luck right. with I that. I may have to cut. Okay, so Andrea has El Dorado. Oh, goodness. Okay. Uh, reserve bourbon, or Woodford Reserve bourbon. Espresso liqueur, red, real gold infused with aromatic smoke. I I really get the bourbonness and the coffeeness. All right, it's pretty good. It's yeah. similar to the Golden Galaxy, but more bourbony. I like their strainers, they're like gold. I know. That looks pretty good. Alright, thank you. Alright, coral charm here. Is that a good one? Uh, yeah, vodka, amaretto liqueur, pineapple, lime juice, dragon fruit, fresh ginger. We saw her muddling the ginger, so. Alright, give us a little go. Oh, yeah, 
tasting amaretto, taste the ginger. Amaretto? Hey, yeah, it's got amaretto. Okay, we have all new appetizers here. So this, I believe, is a crawfish strudel. Yeah. So Andrea will let you know how that is. So this is also on the emeralds menu. Definitely crawfish. And I was afraid it was gonna be like hot or spicy, but that's not bad. Not at all. Mm. And this kind of tastes like a, Thousand Island type thing, but yeah, they it's got corn. They describe it as corn rumelad, but it does taste a lot like Thousand yeah. Island. All right, so I pretty much wiped this out. The f crust was super flaky, really good crust. So for a crawfish strudel, I, I, I've had crawfish before, didn't really care for it. That was good. All right, so this one is new as well. It's roasted duck roll with scallions and a sweet garlic sauce. This one's really good too. That's got a lot of heat to it and sweet too. So, very good. You like we yours? Had two very good appetizers. So. Yeah, and they're both brand new. So, and we like these. Restaurants on board. As a reminder, we do have our Rudy cereal, we have our Parahai Pai 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 Steakhouse, and our Bonsai Tepanyaki. And last but not the least, on the last Sydney, <laughs> we are hosting our special. <laughs> Alright, we have two new entrees here. Well, actually, it's gonna be three okay. Szechuan shrimp, a spicy shrimp, and then the noodles bok choy. So, that looks really good. We're gonna share this and let you know. And then I have Emerald's uh, barbecue salmon. So barbecue salmon, onion rings on top, homemade Worcestershire sauce. All right, Andrea has hers. Look at this. Vegetable, Vegetable Wellington. Wellington. I'm so excited. Yeah, that's that's another new one. Look how good that looks. It looks really lovely. And then yeah. got a little bit of asparagus kind of draped on the sides. That's the kind of Wellington I like. You like that? I don't need me. Just give me all of that cheese and a puff pastry. <laughs> All right, so on this one, my first impression, it does have a skin. I would, I don't think I would eat a skin. And it's a little fishy, so that's my first impression on this one. But yeah, that one's really good, I tried this. I got a, ready to dive into these onion rings, those look great. They look lovely. And then she said hers was great, so there we go. Three new entrees. All right, so I just tried Andrea's vegetable Wellington. Even though that's like a French dish, it tastes very Italian. So yeah, I quite like that. Vegetable Wellington. And I've already tried this too. This is very good as well. And I'll try Andy's salmon and see what I think of that. And I'm definitely right. gonna get into those onion rings. Yeah, of the three, unfortunately, that, yeah, that one would be at the, towards the bottom. So new desserts as well. I was saying normally for cheesecake, you gotta go to the steakhouse or shh, Royal Caribbean. <laughs> but yeah, here it is, cheesecake in the main dining room. So I'm very excited. One of my favorites, Andrea's looks good. And this was called the Naval Orange Cake. It's like a shortcake, but like a orange flavor. It's pretty good. All right. No added sugar. Very good. Cheesecake, this looks great. Little strawberry sauce. Yeah. All right. I'm sure I will like this. A pretty good cheesecake. Oh, yeah, not bad.
is the end of day one. As you see, we had a very early morning arriving in Galveston at 2.15 a.m. this morning. And we have made it to 11 o'clock p.m. And we are calling it. Uh, it was a fairly simple process getting to uh, the cruise port and on the ship. So everything was smooth sailing. No pun intended. We checked out a couple of the areas on the ship, but it's very similar to Celebration in Mardi Gras. Uh, we got to check out the Golden Mermaid and a few other um, new spots as well. But so far, everything has been going well. Uh, had a good dinner, as you saw at the main dining room. And we got to see the show in the theater called Dear Future Husband. It was pretty good, nice singing, so, but we are calling it, tomorrow is a sea day, so, see ya.